Namaste to all. Welcome to the YouTube channel of RSV Group of School. In this session, we will discuss the magnetic effect of current. This is a topic from the chapter number 14 of class 7 science that is electric current and its effect. In the previous video, previous videos we have seen that what is electric current, uh, what is electric circuit, what are its components that we have discussed, how the electric current flows in the circuit. We have also seen one of the effect of electric current that is the heating effect effect of electric current that we have discussed in previous video. We are heading towards the end of the chapter. This is the part third of this chapter. In this, in this part we will discuss the magnetic effect of current. So before understanding the magnetic effect of current, first we will try it to understand with the help of an activity. For this activity what you need you need a magnetic compass. Magnetic compass is a compass basically used uh, to see the directions. It generally points towards the north and south directions and is used to see the directions. So magnetic compass is needed, a wire is needed, switch, battery, a bar magnet and a matchbox cardboard. Matchbox ke andar jo cardboard aata hai, jo khali jaga, khali wala cardboard hota hai, that is needed. So what you have to do, you have to put a setup according to this. Uh, see this diagram, according to this, uh, we have plugged in, a, uh, plugged in a switch, it is a battery and a wire, a long wire which is coiled on the cardboard, matchbox cardboard ke upar humne usko achhi tarah se kya kar diya, coil kar diya. Aur us matchbox ki jo empty space hai, jo beech mein jo jaga hai, us mein we have kept the magnetic compass in it. Now as you all know magnetic compass shows the direction according uh, to the magnetic effect of earth. Earth ke andar bhi baut badi ek magnet hai jiske karan wo apna direction dikha paata hai jo compass hota hai. Similarly first what you have to do uh, you have just keep it switch off. Bring a bar magnet near to the magnetic compass. This magnetic needle ya phir compass ke paas mein ek aapko bar magnet Bar magnet which has the north and south direction shows the magnetic effect as you will bring the bar magnet near to the magnetic compass it will show the deflection it will show some deflection now now what you have to do keep the bar magnet aside and then switch on how you will switch on you just have to connect these both points as you will switch it on the magnetic compass will show the deflection the magnetic compass will show the deflection. Now, if when you will switch it off, again at that time, the magnetic compass will show the deflection. So this is the activity which was first performed accidentally by a scientist named Orested, who has discovered this effect that is the magnetic effect of electric current. Now, what is the conclusion of this particular activity, we have seen that conclusion is that deflection in magnetic compass when electric current passes through it. Okay, so from here we can conclude that what is the magnetic effect of current. So magnetic effect of current can be defined as when current flows through a conductor. Whenever current flows through a conductor, conductor means uh, any substance uh, which allows electricity to pass through it is known as conductor. So when current flows through a conductor, it behaves like a magnet. Yes students, I hope you are surprised by knowing this effect. Whenever current flows through a conductor, it behaves like a magnet and this is known as magnetic effect of electric current. We have also seen the heating effect of electric current in which when the electric current flows through a wire or a conductor, it starts producing heat. We have seen the applications of heating effect of electric current. Similarly, this effect of electric current also has certain applications or certain uses. One of the most major use of magnetic effect of electric current 
is electromagnet. You all might have seen an electromagnet, or some of you have also seen uh, made a practical or made a demonstration. आपने कोई जो है डेमो बनाया होगा किसी साइंस के एग्जीबिशन में आपने इलेक्ट्रोमैग्नेट जरूर देखा होगा या फिर बनाया भी होगा इट इज क्वाइट इजी टू ड्रॉ अ इलेक्ट्रोमैग्नेट हाउ यू कैन ड्रॉ इलेक्ट्रोमैग्नेट व्हाट यू नीड यू जस्ट एज यू कैन सी दिस डायग्राम यू नीड अ वायर अ स्विच अ बैटरी और अ सेल इज रिक्वायर्ड एंड अ नेम आयरन नेम इज रिक्वायर्ड व्हाट यू हैव टू डू रैप द वायर Along the iron nail. Suppose this is the iron nail. Wrap the wire around this. Okay, and then take out the wire. Or the wire has to connect to the switch and battery case. And put some uh, iron objects here. Here, there are some iron objects. For example, iron jump pins. So the iron jump pins, small pins, keep it here. Before switching it on, the switch on is not here, and the current is not flowing. At that time. these iron pins will not be attracted by this nail which is used inside the circuit but as you will switch it on jaise hi aap uska switch on karenge what will happen as the electric current will flow through the nail this nail start behaving like a magnet okay that is the magnetic effect of electric current it start behaving like a magnet and it start attracting this pins towards it and these pins Will at, will attach, will attach to this iron nail. Okay. Now, when you will switch it off again, जब आप उसको दोबारा switch off करेंगे, जैसे switch off करेंगे, again बेटा ये iron nails आपके according these iron nails will keep stick to it or will uh, just fall down. That means electromagnetic जो effect है उसका show करेगा continue या फिर नहीं करेगा. No. it will not show this iron will only show the its magnetic effect in the presence of electric current when the electric supply is stopped when you will stop the electric supply these nails will fall down that means this uh, nail is no longer a electromagnet so i hope you got it the some idea of electromagnet now so basically what is electromagnet a magnet that runs on electricity if electricity supply is switched off the magnet stops working a current carrying coil a proper definition what you will write in the exam a proper definition of electromagnet is a current carrying coil current carrying coil when the wire is wrapped around this nail this is a current carrying coil a current carrying coil of insulated wire insulated wire means all of you know the wires the electric supply in our homes the wires jo hote hain wo insulated hote hain you know insulated uske kuch plastic ki covering hoti hai jisse hame electric shock na lage insulated means the bad conductor of electricity to so, usi wire ka hame insulation uske upar coil karna hai to so, current of insulated wire wrapped around a piece of iron iron ki nail pe apne usko wrap kar diya is called electromagnet So this is the proper definition of electromagnet. Do you remember any use of electromagnet? Where it can be used? It has several applications. You might have seen some large cranes which pick out the iron objects from the junkyards. Junkyards से जो बड़ी-बड़ी iron nails, iron के objects को निकालती है, वहाँ पे electromagnet use किया है. When the accidentally, accidentally when some iron objects fall into the eye, those are also picked. up by the doctor using the electromagnet so there are several uses of electromagnet electromagnet is also used in the formation of electric bell jo apne schools mein office mein jo electric bell lagi hoti hai that also based on the principle of electromagnetism electromagnet he present hota hai uske andar that we will see let's see some points about electromagnet the power of electromagnet can be increased or decreased according to the requirement hamari requirement ke according hum electromagnet ke power ko increase or decrease kar sakte hain kaise how by in, by the flow of current if you will increase the flow of current how the flow of current can be increased if we if you use a battery of higher voltage 
If you use a battery of higher voltage here, the current supply will increase. When the current supply will increase, the power of the electromagnet also increases. That means it can hold more weights. Okay, that's why the power of electromagnet can be used according to the requirement. If you require electromagnet of high power, the power can be increased by increasing the current. If you require a low power electromagnet, then reduce the amount of current flowing in the electric circuit by reducing the amount of batteries or cells that you are using in the electric circuit. One more way to increase uh, or decrease the power of electromagnet is the amount of turns, number of turns. Turns means आपने जितनी बार उस नेल के ऊपर उस आयरन को रैप आयरन की नेल के पे जितना बार वायर को रैप किया है, those are known as turns. If you will increase the number of turns, जितने ज़्यादा turns present होंगे, the power of electromagnet increases. And then if the number of turns present in the coil are less, the power of electromagnet is less. Similarly, last point. Electromagnet stop working when electric current stop. So at this this point we have seen. Uh, so this was the basic information about the electromagnet. Thus we have seen the working of electromagnet. Uh, this working the principle of electromagnetism and this electromagnet is also used in the formation of electric bell. How the electric bell works and what is the process of electromagnetism in the electric bell. That we will see in the next video. Thank you.